Ngayong araw ay pinag-usapan na naman si Kai Soto sa Australia dahil sa magandang nagagawa nito sa NBL at trending. Napag-usapan nga si Kai Soto sa isang show na The Jump at sa caption nga itinawag pa si Kai Soto na next big star sa NBL. Ayon sa isang Jose, ibang klase raw ang ingay na nadadala ni Kai Soto ngayon sa NBL. na share pa nga ng show na projected second round pick si Kai Soto ayon sa kanila ngayong 2022 NBA Draft. Sinabi naman ng isa na si Kai Soto daw ay malaki, malakas at may tira pa sa labas. At base daw sa napanood niya, e eh aggressive daw maglaro si Kai Soto. At ang pinakamaganda daw kay Kai, e eh sobrang dami nitong followers. Sinabi pa ng host na dapat daw bigyan ng pagkakataon si Kai na makapaglaro sa NBA dahil maganda daw ang may papakita nito. Mailang pinag-usapan pa sila at sinabi patungkol kay Kai. Halina't panore natin. Now this one's for Copes because I know he wants to talk about this man who's been making waves in the NBL and I'm talking about Kai Soto, of course, from the Adelaide 36ers. Coach CJ Bruton said yesterday he has what it takes to play in the NBA and it's not a case of if but when. And certainly he has been excellent. Copes, your thoughts? Is he NBA ready? He is. He's big, he's, he's strong, he can shoot the ball from the outside. Um, and, he, and he's aggressive. I love the fact that when you put him in the game, he goes right at the basket. You know? and, and the best thing about him is he has a lot of followers. He's from the Philippines, and they they eat, sleep, and breathe basketball over there. So he's a superstar in the Philippines, and I think he will do quite well. Give him a shot. I think he'll do well in the NBA. Well, he's still got a lot of developing to do. And there, there's certain parts of his game that, that he would concede he's, he's got to work on, and also his physical... Uh, development and his conditioning but right there is a good sign when in, in the the dying moments big basket to step up and those big guys when it comes to the NBA they're they're always going to get a look uh, you know I remember my dad used to say when the start of practice and you're bringing in the guys that the big guys you've got 12 months to show me what you can't do little guys you got me one session to show me what you can do mm. so the nba have that same sort of mindset when it comes to yeah. those big guys that are skilled so he's going to get a look and and i think that he'll get an opportunity at some stage he's still i think outside the top 60 in those projected nba drafts i think mahade king's sort of a- ahead of him in, in those ranks kane yeah he struggled for minutes early in the season so this is uh, kind of a benefit of isaac humphrey's missing some time for the 36ers he's come into the rotation had a couple of double digit scoring games uh, we saw the following on that graphic there, 298,000 Instagram followers, similar to you, Gazy, but... Way more uh, than us, Kay. <laughs> but he actually had 156,000 views on his highlights on the NBL YouTube, uh, the ESPN Australia YouTube page. He's more famous uh, than you, Gazy. He's more famous <laughs> than you. <laughs> Maybe. He might be. He I know you don't be. like it. I know you don't like it, bro. <laughs> no, he's certainly doing some exciting things and bringing a lot more fans to the NBL.